Palestine Liberation Organization, Yasser Arafat, was working official Washington today. ABC's John McCarthy on how he did. This may be Yasser Arafat's first visit to Washington, but he attacked this city with such an effective public relations campaign today that it left even veteran politicians clucking with admiration. Well, he's a very engaging personality, there's no question about that. He spoke in excellent English. Uh, he uh, was very uh, well informed on all the issues involved. Both senators and House members scrambled to get Arafat's autograph. That has been autographed by both Rabin and Mr. Arafat. That's fantastic. How do you feel about it? I was sweating. <laughs> I mean, I've, I've met the Queen at the New Arafat, who for decades was branded a terrorist by the U.S. government, worked hard to convince lawmakers that everything has changed, and the U.S. government should now support the PLO instead of fighting it. At the National Press Club, he was asked when he thought the U.S. would officially recognize the PLO. Actually, yesterday, yesterday I was in the White House. <laughs> it's not a joke. It's not a joke. I have a short... Uh... <laughs> Believe me, it wasn't a joke. And his appearances today all over Washington were not a joke either. They represent a deadly serious effort to win financial and political support and to radically change the image of Arafat himself. John McQuethy, ABC News, the State Department.